Hello. Um, look, you guys. I really want to commit, okay? But my discomfort and my hopelessness are so bad that guess what? The planet will have to suffer first. But I know you'll understand because you can't give someone uh, a functional situation until they, you know, sell their soul, right? <laughs> That's what it feels like, okay? Because I grew up on the frontier and I can't find anyone else like me who is alive, okay? And, um... You know, I really, I really wanted to save the day. I want to, I don't really understand, okay, what the whole deal is. I just hear occasional little bits, and I would like to hear, I'd like to map it out to do the whole thing, you know, to figure the whole thing out, get it perfectly leveled, to sort of, really sort of quantify whatever, maybe it's this, I'm not sure. We don't know, right? Where, where is the balance? That's what I want to find. You know, I want to... I want to inspire people. Okay, I want to do that. But if I'm constantly just in some hopeless um, poverty, okay, and and it's really social poverty because I know people would love to say, look, there's that guy and there's his wife. Thank God if it wasn't for her, what would we do? Um, you know, we'd, we'd probably panic. You know, we'd probably freak out. We'd probably go, never, never mind. You know, we'd just like run away from everything. But I, I want to do that. But it... This is how it's working out, is that, um, you know, George Washington can't get his education, and therefore the world crashes and burns. The world, the environment, the clean air, the civil society, all that good stuff that we want, we simply place on the scapegoat, and we expect him, him to know what to do. And I don't know what to do, okay? All I know is I need to get away to understand it, you can't see the picture um, from too close up. And I know that I have traveled before and I've understood the problems in these other places. And if I were to travel some more, but you know, I need some place to go. It's not just more. It's, it's, you know, I need a, I need to be, I need to find accommodation. I need to have my own accommodation. You know, my own little escape pod. That's why. I'm floundering now, and while I was floundering then, you know, you might think, oh, well, you've got a skateboard, why don't you just live on that, you know, it's like, yeah, yeah, right, you know, that's the saying, why don't you just burn the world, because that's the rationale that the terrorists, the lone wolves, that's what they're hearing, okay, they're, they're hearing, we don't care, we will never care, you know, just burn the world, just, just find that scapegoat and just, you know, let it suffer, let the whole planet suffer, let humanity suffer, let thousands, maybe millions of innocent people die because that guy in the frontier, Georgie Porgy, you know, he's got a dollar. Why doesn't he just save himself? And this is this is the problem. You guys gotta understand that I want to I want to to be a good guy. I want to be the savior, you know? I want to do that. But I gotta have some comfort. If I don't have it, you're just gonna say, oh, well, the world's burning. Let's take a photograph, you know, and everything's hunky dory. But um, please help me. I will save the world, you know, but I gotta find a place to do it. I really do.